Um, Wait, so he was he was a president, a funk musician, and a baseball player? Yeah, very busy. Gets around. Yeah, like Jeff uh, Goldblum. Also, it was Jeff Goldblum doing a Bill Clinton impersonation. <laughs> Oh, wait, what if Bill Clinton has a really good Jeff Goldblum? Oh, I bet he does. He's an entertainer. Clinton? He can play the saxophone. He can. Art says, Keith lives in Massachusetts and hasn't heard of the Garden State Parkway. I don't spend a lot of time memorizing the roads from other states. <laughs> <laughs> uh, D-Vax says that, that uh, she says, the practical logic course was fun. Oh, my God, Austin, I feel so much PhD student camaraderie right now. True facts. It was. It was a good logic course. Like, logic is fun I, in general. I was about to take a logic course, and then my school canceled it because not enough people signed up. That happens. Yeah, it's the worst. Yep. For us, the practical logic thing was a requirement for the for the undergrad philosophy um, thing, so it had to be given. But it was also um, more than, like, the formal logic oh. course, the practical logic well, course so was thing people took. This, this was also a requirement for philosophy. For philosophy. Oh, weird. So it was major and major. But so what happened was they had to remake the class as an online class and didn't let any of the non-philosophy majors or non requirement oh, people take it. Yeah, it right, was crazy. Right. Wait, so are we going back already? What are you doing? No, I'm just checking. My, why does he hate us oh, so okay. much? Because he's a baby. I was, yeah. Oh, it's Gavelkind Succession. What's Gavelkind, Dustin? I think, is that... Gavel, it's not a, Gavelkind is... Uh, it's not is when you, It splits up it's, between all of... It's when it, it splits right. up between all of the kids evenly. The titles of the rulers are divided among the children, with the oldest getting the primary title. If the ruler has no children who can inherit, the law defaults to primogeniture. You get no prestige penalty for having unlanded sons and can have a 30% larger domain. Gavelkind is a very popular law with everyone except the oldest child. Because <laughs> <Right. laughs> they right. feel that it should be theirs. Destruction of titles while under gavel kind is not allowed. Women can inherit, but only if there are no eligible males. Right. All right, I'm cool with rolling for that for a while. Um, how's it going down here? Oh, hang on. I guess the old king died. We need to kill this kid. We need to kill Linda. Um, <laughs> what are the odds? I'd probably very low. Forty. What are the odds yeah. on him? Sixty-five. I mean, wait, do we even need... Why do we need to kill these people instead of just taking it over? True. Because, again, like, that's the thing, right? Like, we can just say, yeah, we want I mean, this I guess now? Yeah, stabilizes the regional level, but... I'm just asking if that's the way it works, actually. But... Where's he going? He's going to Ulster. They're all marching in that, in a general... Yeah, oh my god, yeah. that city's on fire. It is, yeah. The same thing was happening with Ulster when we were done with it. It was great. Yeah, um, still on fire. Wow. Mario Dotra says logic was my favorite sequence in my philosophy major. I logic's great. Is though I I don't know if this is maybe just me, but the worst philosophy class was intro to philosophy because it mm. was just a bunch of people that thought it would be the easiest class in the world. Right, right. It's uh, intro also, courses oh. intro courses are super hit and miss. Not just yeah. in not just like depending on what school you're at, but even depending on who that year is teaching an intro course. It can be someone who really knows their stuff. It can be an adjunct. It can yeah. be someone who has been teaching it for two decades and hates teaching that same intro material. I have some really good That's adjuncts, it. though. Right, right. Um, um, my, one of my favorite classes that I ever took, I actually took two classes from her, a, a uh, uh, screenwriting class and a playwriting class. Mm -hmm. And both of she she was a great professor but also both of them were just filled with people who uh oh, I was pregnant again nice oh great just filled filled with people who didn't expect there to be work in those classes i don't mm -hmm. know like just didn't there was one person who set who in the playwriting class who dropped the class because uh they didn't realize that there was going to be <laughs> they wouldn't have to they would have to read plays <laughs> In the playwriting class, they like Ooh, they didn't boy. think that reading that's, plays was part of that. That's a shame. They they really yeah. are not all right. Uh, just just let. Would you do? I just let okay, it go. Yeah, yeah. Um, um, and then so uh, just to people are saying, <laughs> Warple Femme says logic is great. You're not convincing me. Uh, I will say that like, so at the time it was stressful and it was uh, tricky and. Uh, I liked it then for different reasons than I like it. Then I'm happy I I did it now. Um, I wait. Are we are we done now? Yeah, we're or are done. We not so, okay. 
Oh, I see. I see. Well, then let's let's do it. Wait, what? It says no navies present, which are large enough to transport army. What the hell? Does that mean we have too much stuff? Well, no. We've got our loot. No. Can it's... we? We can definitely fit them on there. It's just. Are you sure? Oh. Are yeah, you no. sure? It's... No. Okay. 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 No, you go. have loot and you have. You have I see. Loot and thingy. Um. So. So the thing about this is like getting a little inside baseball. Uh, but when I was in undergrad, my my program and my department was largely what's called uh, was largely made of people who studied what's called analytic philosophy, um, which is very logic driven. Um, very, I don't want to generalize too much, uh, which you kind of have to do when saying this stuff. But um, very concerned with kind of broad, abstract phil philosophical problems. Um, of things like metaphysics and ontology, like questions of broad categorization, questions about the nature of life, or not life, but the nature of the universe, the nature of math, the nature of experience, right? And that stuff was great. Uh, and also, like, hard logic um, arguments around that. Uh, and so learning that logic was really good because now what I do is something that I guess you would call continental philosophy. Um, because it, it kind of originates from the continent of Europe. That's, versus, wait, that's free breakfast philosophy? Right, free breakfast philosophy. That's the philosophy uh, of free the, breakfast. Listen, it's basically, many... the, it's basically the philosophy of like the sort of conversations you have over free breakfast. Like, oh, so hey, did you so see in the like paper? How, many, how much of this free bacon can I fit on my, my plate no, before it's go? No. It's like while you eat that shitty hotel bacon, you're saying like, hey, man, shit's really fucked up in Ukraine right now. What can we do about this? Um, and that's and I benefited greatly from having that hard logic uh, taught to me because now I'm way more critical about the, my own arguments and about like making sure that I'm internally consistent and that my rhetoric makes sense uh, to people, uh, things like that. Hmm. Guys, we can take yeah yeah. Um, Let's fucking do it. Let's do it. Uh, look, oh, he, he has, has nothing. Well, he has 319 men. We have uh -huh. 556 men. Nice. Let's oh, we can it. stomp this guy. All right, here we go. Oh, he's got nice hair, though. Um, listen up, fucker. We're going to declare war on you because of subjugation of Norway. <laughs> <laughs> so wait, what's it say? Uh, pagans um, are allowed to subjugate other pagan rulers once in their lifetime. Okay. With the become king ambition, there is no oh, such that's time rad. To targets within the kingdom. Yeah, so now this will allow this one ruler and all of his sons free reign over all of Norway. What will? Subjugation Wait. of Norway. So you declare subjugation of Norway. That means that I see. you now I have see. automatic castle on all of Norway. Okay, cool. Not just this one place, Gaia. Yeah, that's Go great. for it. Right. Also, um, hey, Bjorn, what's the deal? You don't like us very much. Um, well, we did just declare war. <laughs> um, Let's do it. Military. What up? And to answer to answer Dvac's question, I think I'm teaching. I don't know. It's tough. Like what I want to do after my PhD. Um, the the field is is rough right now. Um, academia in the humanities and social sciences is super competitive, and I'll probably spend a decade teaching as an adjunct with no benefits and with a crazy workload. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. I need to seriously consider going into the private sector and, like, I don't know. It's stressful. Okay, cool. This guy has nothing before him? Nope. Basically? Okay. Fire John says that I'm wrong, uh, in l that it's only the one place unless that, uh, unless you have the ambition to be mm -hmm. king of Norway. Is that a thing that you have or nope. have access to? Not yet. Not yet. We, can, we can get that, though. Oh. That's an ambition yeah. we'll take at some point. We got a we got a, a big boost because we're in mountains and stuff. Great, we're besieging. Yeah, I'm with you, Dean Mac. The academia is in a fucking place right now, and I, I can very much see myself bouncing from trying to get sweet deal after sweet deal post you know post doctorate positions and stuff. Mm -hmm. Um, but I don't know. Okay. Um, so should yes. Should we call it Bjorn? Or should we, we get something else? Another name? Yeah, should we get another name? Shall we? What should we call we, it? Well, we have Toke already, and I think that we should just start naming all of our children 
uh, like different Swift. nicknames from that one <laughs> song by the Steve Miller band. Oh, okay. I thought you were going to say be different... mid- can, this, can this sun be midnight smoke is what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> it, could be, it, could be, it could be smoke spelled could, in a... I could go for smoke, yeah. Yeah, like, but like spelled or, in a funny Maurice. way. Maurice, wow, wow. No, I don't think that's it. Yeah, it's, yeah, smoke. I'm with it. Okay, cool. That looks a bit like smoke, but it's de- that's definitely an E. Cool. Good. Oh, wait, we got two sons. We got twins. Whoa, what's up, twins? twins? All right, so smoke and... Hrothgar. Joke. <laughs> so then we have toke, smoke, smoke and joke. joke. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Cool, because he's a toker, uh, 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 a toker smoker, a, a midnight joker. Right. Yeah, cool. Joke. Yep, that's Some people right. call him the spaced cowboy. <laughs> Uh, Some call him the gangster of love. We'll get there. All right. All right. With, the, all, oh, with all the all these kids, I think Jack is the gangster of love. That's true. <laughs> no, no, um, b- no. What? Oh no. That's the wrong person. I'm not the gangster <laughs> Say, of love. Saying? Snorri is. Yes. Snorri, yeah. Um. Soltron. Tell you what, he doesn't spend much time snorrying. No, Snorri, snorrying. Dumb. Maybe Snorri has a maybe Snorri has a euphemism. <laughs> no. You wanna go have a little uh a little Snorri? Huh? No, Snorri sounds like a really worryingly specific euphemism. Uh, <laughs> I can't imagine for uh, what. Yeah. Um Alright, how's this war going over here? How's the well, war going over here? I'm going okay. Lumber Jack says I've talked to enough teachers to never ever want to teach. Uh everyone in my whole family is a teacher. Yeah. Like I love it. I love the process of teaching, and I, yeah, what Soltron just said. I hate the bullshit that comes with it. Um, yeah, the act of of standing in front of a class and talking to them, or especially students who come to office hours and want to work through problems and stuff they don't understand, or get specific feedback on papers they've written, or get get wait, feedback. On wait, 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 wait! Stop the presses. Miss Cooks in the chat says "snorry" is a childish word for penis. Yeah. Like, <laughs> Awesome. <laughs> Sorry, carry on, Austin. I just felt <laughs> yeah, that, that no, needed to. That's... Welcome to stream, friends, everyone. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> yep, we got we got we got a guy called Penis of Angerman Land, and his sons, Toke, Smoke, and Joke. Mm-hmm. Just good stuff. Sorry, carry on. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, I think that was it. That was all I got. Lower yeah, Jack we... says the confidence of swag. <laughs> <laughs> Matt says, t- "Name your new steward. Take the money and run." <laughs> I don't. By the way, uh, don't ever name your your heirs' siblings anything mm-hmm. that implies they might try to take over. Because every time I've ever done that, they've tried to take over. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. Um, I Alice named is... every, I named two different uh, uh, siblings of heirs Pretender, and both of those people made claims on the throne. <laughs> Offering this guy peace. Yes. Good. Same thing with the character I named Benedict. It also happened. Snorri Frambok has become chief of Yamtaland. <laughs> uh, so what happened to this guy? Oh, he, he, he's just still existing in the world. Um, okay. I was going to check my... Pr- oh, I was going to slow down time. And then I was going to check my prison. And then I think we should probably wrap it up for the evening, because I know another stream's oh, happening. Um, yeah, in shortly. Time, so, yeah. 930 oh, who's streaming? Nick and Kelsey are playing an adventure game that has a ghost in it. Oh, I think. I like- oh, uh, Blackwell Legacy. Blackwell. Blackwell Legacy. They're going to finish that. And then they're going to stay on, and Phil's going to join them, and they're going to play Murdered Soul Suspect. And we're going to have a special guest on that. Um, we're going to have, I think, Arden? Is, is that right, Jack? I think I'd seen something about that earlier. I don't know if Arden is joining, but that, that could be really cool. It's I'm pretty like sure that's what I'd seen. Yeah. Why can't we ransom prisoners in a short time? Can we only ransom kind of like one prisoner at a time? You, you can only short- ransom prisoners that uh, have lieges that can pay for the ransom. Oh. Okay. And sometimes they still won't. 
Right. How have we only got a 44% chance of success when he's literally in our dungeon? Of doing what? Assassinating him? Yeah. I don't know. You gotta sneak past all your guards. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna stand down my troops. I'm gonna stand down my troops, stream <laughs> friends, and then I'm gonna <laughs> pause the game. Let's get back to the pretty map. Okay. So next time, we should start, you know, getting claims on Metal Pod and her Jadal. <laughs> Good. Good Viking. Uh, Good Viking. We can rename it. Instead of Mabel Pad, we can rename it Metapod. <laughs> <laughs> like the Pokemon. Um, yes! It's on the map, so uh, so the the chat can't see it. But look at that crest. That's a cool looking crest. That's a that's a pretty that's a pretty swag stag. It's like another I, swag stag. Yeah, it's a it's swag a different, stag rival right. in It is. Yeah, Yadal. Uh, Yadal. Yeah. yeah, so um I am Jack DeKeat. You can find me on uh, Twitch and Twitter at NotQuiteReal. Um, who have I been joined with this evening? I'm Austin underscore Walker on Twitter, the Calgary Tech here on Twitch, ClockworkWorlds.com to read the stuff that I write. Uh, also, you guys should check out StreamFriends.tv for our archives, where uh, as of an hour and 45 minutes ago, the second episode of Star Wars Conquest went up. They'll oh, be going man. at 7 p.m. Eastern every day for the next couple of days. Really for the next like week or two, I guess. Um, so so please watch that. That was a blast. Uh, my name is Keith Carberry. You can follow me on Twitter at Something Dumb. Uh, you can watch the Let's Plays that I do at YouTube.com slash RunButton or RunButton.net. Uh, and you can do see Twitch stuff at RunButton. No, not that. didn't start with that. It starts with Twitch.tv slash RunButton. <laughs> Uh, and I'm going to go over there. I'm going to do a thing like pretty much right now also. Cool. Of, of Sonic Adventure 2. Well, thank you everybody for joining us. Your um, your kind of Scandinavian focused homework this week is to watch the film Troll Hunter. It's set in Norway instead of Sweden. But it's it's got that particular kind of like icy, tundra-y, bleak tone. And it's a film that I really recommend. It's pretty good. Is this a new thing? Are we going to end every Jack stream with a film recommendation? Or a thing recommended. It's not a new... Th I was literally... I was looking at those place names and it reminded me a little of Troll Hunter and I thought, you know what I should do? I should recommend Troll Hunter. But now I'm going to have to think of a thing to recommend next yeah, time. I'm with but yeah, I'm with tro Troll Hunter's really good. Um, I really enjoyed it. I watched it over Christmas. All right, cool. Have a good evening, everybody. Thank you so much for joining us. Bye, Internet. Bye.